what's going on y'all so tonight's gonna be episode two of my local legend series i'm headed to meet murray reagan and randy thielen gonna be hunting with some english dogs tonight uh hatchy river kennels uh it's a good night good and clear it's about 40 degrees hope the coon's gonna be moving good it's gonna be a good dark night but anyway so headed to the bottoms now to meet them we'll see y'all We're gonna turn loose right here. That's why I say just let him yep. run. Yep. I think he wants to see a picture of your dog. Okay. Let me get my... And that's Kim. What dog are you hunting tonight, Randy? This is a seven-month-old pup out of Kraken and Mason. Murray, what are you hunting tonight? I'm hunting Kim. She's very nice chunky out of out of JoJo and. Uh... Um, and we're, we're all pretty much from West Tennessee. It's Peanut, he's from around Scotts Hill, is that what you said, Randy? Yeah. Yeah, about yeah. 10 miles south of Scotts Hill. A little yep. community called Bath Springs, Tennessee. Sniper's out of uh, Vapor and Late Night Show Out, which is uh, show out of that out of Hatchie River Dotty. I always go back to Hatchie River Dotty. And you, you still have, grand you still grand have pups. Dottie at home? No, Dottie, she's, uh, she died okay. uh, two, about three years ago. And we buried her at the Coon Dog oh. Cemetery in Cherokee, oh. Alabama. I remember that now. Yeah. Yep. JoJo directly out of Dottie. And JoJo's still the one you have. <clears throat> yeah, I got her messed up with Dottie. Yeah. Peanut, who you hunt? I a dog called Sniper. Male dog's about... A little old three year old, three and a half, something like that. You got some wins on him, right? Yeah, Quite he's, <laughs> he's a grand night champion. <laughs> he's won about seven, a little over 7,000 PKC, 4,000 Pro Sport, 2,000 UKC. He's a world champion senior English dog. The PKC world champion senior punt. Yeah, senior English. Yeah. When'd you get the uh, Hatchy River going, Murray? It's been a. Oh, it's been probably uh, uh, 15, 20 years ago. It all started with Carter Long with Hard Time Kim. And she's Rocky Bread. And I got a male dog out of her and uh, Thunder St. Nick. And his name was. Uh, he, he was out of. Uh, he produced the uh, Hatchy River Dotty. His name was Rebel Thunder. And Dottie, everything else I hunt is grand pups out of Dottie now. I bred her to, uh, with, I think, nine different stud dogs. I took the best stud dogs I could find. And the more I could see them on the uh, historical reproducers list, the better I liked it, and especially the ones that were winning. And those are ones I bred to, it didn't matter how far or what the stud fee was, that's what I did for several years with and Randy and Peanut are helping to keep this line going. You come a long way with these dogs too. Put a lot of time in on it. Yes, sir. <laughs> it takes a lot of time. <clears throat> yeah. Now, I, I was continuously trying to improve the breed, the bloodline. And I, I was focusing on the winners that reproduce winners and the reproducers that reproduce. And it's, it's, uh, it works pretty good. Well, we can cut them loose if we can get into it tonight. Sniper, you don't, you don't see him very long. He, he takes off. He's a rocket ship. He, uh, he'll go.
dogs are all split pretty deep. Peanut's going to his dog back across there, and we're trying to figure out how to get to these other dogs through this thick stuff here. We can get closer. He should have come with us. He could have drove the sniper right there. So Randy's pup and Murray's dog split treat in here. Yeah. Uh, so what happened was uh, Peanut's dog got real deep, like two miles. Uh, he had to go get him. And uh, Randy and Murray's dogs got ended up getting real deep too. Murray's getting them rounded up. And uh, we're just gonna make another drop. Go ahead. Coming back. Oh, yeah. I bet you did. <clears throat> oh. Sniper, he's on that road. Which road? The one you just drove down. Okay. Here, Here Randy. Right there. They're fairly close together, aren't they? Uh, sniper's way ahead. Is he? <laughs> He's never behind. He's on the road you just <laughs> drove down. Okay. Or you can go back to that cornfield. Well, I'm just going to wait on y'all. I mean, it looks like he's. they're all both the same direction. Are, are they pretty close, Murray? They're about a, oh, about a half mile. <laughs> yeah, but they're the same direction. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, I'll just wait till. I mean, as long as he's not close to that uh, Great River Road or anything. Is there a way to come in? And... There you go. So. So twelve now. You're a big man, Murray. You want to see this one out? Yeah. 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 Shoot it.
two more up there. One right there, one right there. She was fixing to leave. Yeah, Johnny, since you're not with me, I thought I'd video it for you. See, at least that way you can tell he, he's treated a coon. That makes a second when you ain't been with me either time. Anyway, now if I can just try to find my way out of this place. Well, we had a good hunt tonight. Uh, the dogs stay split most of the time. Moon came out, it was cold, coons wasn't down, they wasn't really moving that great. Um, I hate we didn't get Sniper, any footage of him, he just stayed gone. Uh, you know, that dog was probably a mile to two miles within two to ten minutes of the first cut. But the bottom we hunted had a lot of old logging roads in it, so Peanut said he'll hit those roads and he just goes and tries to ambush one. But like I said, we could tell the coons as we got on further into the hunt was not moving that great. So there at the end, Randy and Murray's dogs was treed together at three in that tree. We go back to the truck and then Peanut gets back with Sniper and he showed me a video where a Sniper had a coon. So again, I hate we didn't get Sniper on film tonight, but that's how it goes sometimes when you have some real independent dogs. But anyway, uh, I've got some more people that I've contacted and some that's contacted me even about doing the local legend series with them. And uh, so looking forward to getting some more of these series coming. So, anyway, had a good hunt, and we'll catch y'all next time. This is Johnny with 731 Outdoors. Y'all keep them treated.